Hey everyone, it's Naomi with My Crafty Personality. I've come together again with Resin and More and we're gonna make this cute little pumpkin. And what I'm gonna focus on here is these little foil inserts that came with my subscription box. They're really neat and cool. It came with both a uh, black and an orange foil insert. So I'm gonna use the orange ones in this project. So the mold came in the box as well as and some of the glitter that I'm using during the project. So what I did first is I put a very thin layer of the clear resin that I had mixed in the area where I'm going to put the foil. And I cut out the foil to the size that I wanted and I gently put it in and making sure that it was completely covered with resin. And you can move the foil to the position that you want it in after you get it in the resin. And then just, again, push it down until you're completely covered and try to get rid of some of those bubbles and then what i did was i mixed some white pigment with some orange colors i had to make this pastel -y orange for the rest of the pumpkin i put them in the little slots and i just made sure that it was filled in with a, th a thin toothpick you will see me here using a blowtorch i would recommend against it for this mold it's very thin and um, can get heated rather quickly and the heat on the silicone will make the resin stick to it so i let that first layer dry overnight and then once it was dried i started with the second layer i first painted the stem a nice gold color basically i took the mica powder with a paintbrush and i just painted it in that area and then i had a little ear swab I put some alcohol on the edge of it and took away any leftover um, powder that went onto the edges of the rest of the mold and then here is my background that I'm using I'm using some glitter that came with my resin subscription box it was a nice Halloween themed glitter I mix it with some clear resin and I first put it around all of the edges so that it can go into the edge and then I just put it in the rest of the mold. I added clear so it can mix nicely and then fill the rest of the mold up so it can make a complete cast. And then I just swirled around. What you'll also see me doing here is putting my stick through the entire edge of the mold to make sure that the resin gets into each crevice and you don't get left with any air pockets. I spread it out and then I just let it dry overnight before I demolded. Here you'll see me demolding and you'll notice that at some areas I am a little bit stuck because I did use that torch tool. It heated up the silicone mold and it, it just dried into the resin. So you'll see some blue areas stuck. Um, but overall the, paint, the piece came out very cute. Check it out. Um, at the end I did scrape out those pieces and then I'll probably end up painting those um, inserts black the the edges of the pumpkin but I think it came out really cute check out the foil and how shimmery it is and the background glitter that kind of peekaboos through very very cute so check out resin and more boxes if you're interested in getting very neat molds and glitters and other little items that you can put into your resin